All right, so I've been sitting here for like two hours trying to do stuff, but I didn't want to do that. Hearts and service. Let's do this. This is actually the first thing I did in VR, like in total. So <clears throat> this is going to be pretty nice. Welcome back to Parts and Service. Jeez, why you gotta be so oh no, Ooh. it looks like Bonnie's guitar is out of tune and must be recalibrated. I do not First, like we this. must access his harmonization module located inside his secondary throat pipe. To access the throat pipe, both eyes must first be removed. You must be as precise as possible when removing the eyes from their respective sockets. First, firmly grip Bonnie's left eye and carefully remove it from its socket. Left eye. That'd be this one. Great job. Ooh. Deposit the left eye in the cleaning receptacle on your left. Well Ooh. done. Now, firmly grip Bonnie's right eye and carefully remove it from its socket. Why am I Deposit so the right eye in the cleaning receptacle on your right. Good job. To open Bonnie's Five. faceplate, Carefully press the two buttons located on either side of Bonnie's jaw. When I done correctly, you should hear two small clicks. All right. I know what's gonna happen. Don't kill me. Well done. You now have access Not to Bonnie's scary. harmonization module. Press the blinking All button right. inside Bonnie's secondary throat pipe to enter <laughs> calibration mode. Something is not right. One of those notes is out of tune. You may push the button again to okay. replay the audio check. I was Press the colored button that corresponds to the incorrect note. Okay, so it's green. Press green. the blinking button again to verify your work. Great job. Bonnie is in tune Ooh. and ready for his solo. Let's close Got him up. Big hands. Simply replace both eyes in the same order that you removed them, then close up the faceplate, and we'll call it a day. This one. This one. Faceplate. Well done. That concludes your parts and services task. See you <laughs> next time. What's in there? That wasn't so hard. Yeah. Ooh, stars. Don't jump scare me. Yay. That's some good candy. All right. All right. All right. Let's do. Uh, pretty sure the next one is Freddy. No, it's Chica. I hate this one because I'm bad at it. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. Welcome to the Freddy Fazbear Virtual Experience. Fazbear Entertainment is excited to join the digital age, and what better way to do that than with an edge-of-your-seat virtual reality experience? Looking out for the games. We know that Fazbear Entertainment has developed something of a bad reputation over the last few decades. And while it's true that hey. some stories associated with our name were loosely based on actual Honest. events, the majority of them were total fabrications from the mind of a complete lunatic. Lawsuits pending. But we aren't above laughing at ourselves. Ha, ha, ha. That's why we have recreated many of these completely fictitious scenarios, lies that you've been fed over the last several years into a hilarious VR game, in the hopes that we can finally move past these childish ghost stories and develop a new relationship with you, as well as your kids. Don't forget the merch perfect for birthdays. So sit back and enjoy a few scares. Bruh. 
ask that you agree to a simple waiver before you play. It's mostly just legal mumbo jumbo and isn't at all based on user experiences thus far or injuries associated with testing. Just touch the button of your to life agree, saved. and then we can jump right into some harmless fun that can't harm you at all in any harmful way. Thank you for playing the Freddy Fazbear Virtual Experience. <laughs> You acknowledge that Fazbear Entertainment that. is not responsible for accidental digital consciousness transference, real-world manifestations Wait, of digital characters, nightmares, night terrors, night sweats. Night terrors? ruh -ro. That doesn't, that doesn't sound good. Something. Freddy Fudge Bar. Prize counter. Oh, why am I so close? No, I'm not letting you fall. So I was gonna do night two. You scared the crap out of me. Yeah, that's right. I'm taller than you. Yeah, that's right. Back off, kid. You're garbage. I'm shorter. Say so we're about <clears throat> same size here. Counting your ears? Maybe up here? Say right here is about where your head is. Yeah, you, you're kind of ugly. Be a pink eye. Nah. I don't think I'm ready for that. I'd probably die. I'd probably get a heart attack. Alright. So, when I first played VR... This one was the first time I got jump scared because I couldn't find the stupid freaking Welcome cupcake. Back to parts and service. There have been customer complaints about Chica's acrid smell. Sounds like Chica has been rummaging around the kitchen again. Remove all food particles from Chica's exterior and place it in the refuse bin on your right. Your cheek yeah. is not hiding any other yeah. treats inside her beak. To open her beak, right, this one kind of just two buttons like, located on the sides of Chica's head. This kind of gets closer to you, so it's kind of. Alright, we are back. Um... Well, that was nice. This one was the first time I got jump scared. Very, uh, perfect timing, I guess. Welcome back to Parts and Service. There have been customer complaints about Chica's acrid smell. Sounds like Chica has been rummaging around the kitchen again. Remove all food particles from Chica's exterior and place it in the refuse bin on your right. Alright. Hopefully I don't punch something. Man. Good job. Perfect. Make sure Chica is not hiding any other treats inside her beak. 
To open her beak, carefully press the two buttons located on the sides of Chica's head. That's my... my war right there. Oh no. It looks Jeez, like Chica has the picked crap up some out unwanted him. friends. To clear the infestation, apply the Fazbear Entertainment Restaurant Grade Chemi Spray to Chica's exterior. Press the button, avoid inhaling the chemi spray. Exposure to cleaning, disinfecting, and chemicals may result in respiratory problems, skin, or eye irritation. Good Ooh. job. Now reattach Chica's upper arm, hand, and cupcake plate. Don't want to accidentally drop it. Here's the part where I will most likely die. Well done. Oh no. It looks like Chica needs another dose of the chemi spray. Do not let the infestation spread. Be sure We're to give the way. canister button another push as needed. You're about to move. Return the cupcake to Chica's plate. Great job. Oh, Chica so is ready to serve pizza and hugs to the kids again. Take a complimentary slice of pizza for a job well done. Yo. <clears throat> Go on. Take it. Delicious. See you next time. Pizza. All right, if I get jump scared this time, I I'm going to hit something. Don't punch my TV. That is my TV. I knew it. I knew it was gonna happen. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Well, all right, um... I'm gonna have to reset stuff now. Oop, alright, now I'm closer. Let's just see if it actually counted. Let's go, alright. Freddy will be the last one for this episode. Please don't be really up close. I'm gonna be taller so he doesn't scare the crap out of me. Welcome back to Parts and Service. It looks like one of our guests Bro, left a personal this guy is so item tall. on our star attraction. Because he's like a foot Let's off the ground. to the lost and found. Carefully, grab and remove the child's hat from Freddy's mouth. Freddy's got a pretty good hold of Good job. Now place the hat <laughs> in the lost and found Yo. bin on your right. Helpy. Let's put that on. While we're at it. Let's make sure there isn't anything else stuck inside. To access Freddy's chest cavity, grab Freddy's bow tie and pull it outwards. Well done. Freddy's chest cavity is now open. Oh, please Remove don't come in and punch my TV. And place it in the lost and found bin. I Be can't careful even reach not that to touch far. any of Freddy's sensitive wiring. Yeah, I can't even grab it. <laughs> Move back. Don't run my hands down. Good job. It appears there is a child's shoe wedged behind Freddy's music box. The music box my must guy, be removed you, before you can you access the child's things? shoe. Gently grasp the music box and extract it from Freddy's chest cavity before the safety latch descends. I press the button. Apparently not. I wasn't listening. <laughs> Something you should always do. <laughs> That's not good. The world just drops down. I'm not I'm not saying that it's like a Welcome back to Parts and Service. Terribly it looks like bad one of our thing, guests but... left a personal item. Freddy's got good job. 
Now place the hat Ooh. in the lost end. While we're at it, let's make sure there isn't. Well done. Freddy's chest cavity is now open. Remove the child's watch and place it in the lost and found bin. Be careful not to touch any of Freddy. Yeah. Get out of here. I'm really bad at this. Welcome back to parts and Go. service, Freddy. Good job. Now place the hat oh my in the pile. Well done. Freddy's chest cavity is now open. <laughs> All right. Remove the child's watch and place it in the you lost and that. found bin. Be careful not to touch any of Freddy's sensitive wiring. Good job. It appears there is a child's shoe wedged behind Freddy's music box. The music box must be removed before you can access the child's shoe. Gently grasp the music box and extract it from Freddy's chest cavity before the safety latch descends. Carefully place the music box on the work table to your left. Great job. To reset the safety latch, press the button located on Freddy's endoskeleton. Now remove the child's shoe and place it in the lost and found bin. That is... Come on, let me grab it. That's my TV. Are you kidding me? Behind my TV. Well done. Return the music box to Freddy's chest cavity, and we'll call it a day. I know exactly what's going to happen. Oh no, you seem to have mishandled Freddy's music box. This is not good. A replacement may be found on the work table. A slow and even pace is recommended. Crisis averted. To close Freddy's chest cavity, press the large black button in the we? center of Freddy's face. That concludes your time in parts and service. Your pay will be docked accordingly. Where is, where was the VHS tape? Cause I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be one in every. Yo, Ennard, my guy. <laughs> fun yet that's great to hear where did he go he was right there yo my dude i want to punch right now that's weird prize counter oh I almost fell over To shoot some hoops. Now you get back here. Huh. What a rat. Yo. 
Vinh Can we see it? Hey! <laughs> I knew it. I knew it would work. My eyes itchy. Hold on, give me a sec. FNAF 1, FNAF, FNAF 2, FNAF 3, FNAF 4. How could I be so bad at this? It's dark rooms. Of course it is. Pretty fudge bear. Do, 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 do. Okay, with the ball rolling like that, and the music playing, that is real creepy. Ah, <laughs> it's all connected. Whoops. Rabbit. Now this is called Ew. That's what it's called. I don't like that. Like black dog floating around, whatever. Uh. Ugh. Boing, boing, boing. Let me press it. Whoa, freaky. See, now the question is, is this where all the peeps are, or is that where Foxy is? And that, that's where Foxy is. Or is this Foxy, and that's where all the peeps are? No idea. Let me in the prize counter, please. Please. Oh. Press button. My hand is currently down here. My hand is right here. Oh, there it is. Let's 
that's my monitor. Or is that my TV? No, that's my monitor. Why does he look like that? Vent repair? I will literally never do that. Night terrors? I'd get night terrors. FNAF 1? You know. Whatever. <laughs> Alright. See ya.